Yo, 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 yo. What's up, what's up, what's up? Na, 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 na. Know what it is. And I am going to do a little bit of Gangnam Life. And he is playing Hamburger Sasu, a TBZ. Pretty sure I haven't done this game, but there is a chance I have. But I don't remember it. And I am doing this on Sunday night, right before Tampa Bay plays the Cowboys. And I think the Cowboys are going to pull it out. Um, but we'll see. Um, I made a couple decent bets this week. Obviously, I was, I was actually pretty disappointed in Hamzat missing weight like he did. I don't know what the whole deal was with that. Um, but obviously, he destroyed Kevin. And, uh, and then the DS fight was crazy. So, uh, that was a great way. I guess he ended at 209, which is, is stocked in 209. So, pretty sick for him to end. Uh, the fight got stopped at uh, 2 minutes and 9 seconds, something like that. So, good stuff, good stuff. Um, we got a TVZ, obviously. And pretty sure this was a picked matchup because going for two barracks and then a refinery is usually how you play. Terran versus Zerg. And yeah, let me know who you guys think is going to win. Um, my Bears actually pulled off the win. I took that money line today, which is pretty sweet. Uh, I put 20 bucks on it and won 40 bucks. So they were able to pull that one out. It was raining like crazy. And uh, good game, I think. Justin Fields did. Made some big plays at the end there. So... So happy that football season's back. And it almost looked like four drones spawned there, but it was three. Kind of delayed, it almost seemed like. It's kind of weird. Gonna try to snipe out this Overlord, but I don't think he can get it because it's on the hill right there. Here's your SCV, gonna get the scout off and gonna die. Here is a factory on the way. And you guys know I love my TVZ. And let's just change up the colors a little bit. So we got eight Marines right here. I think he is a little worried. Sees that Overlord. He's a little worried about Lings, it almost seems like. And gonna move that Overlord out of there. So nicely done by Sasu. <clears throat> hope everyone had a good weekend here's your academy yeah so probably gonna go right into a starport after this yeah and two medics will probably come so probably make two more marines and then he'll make two more medics let's see what's going on over here here's your lair on the way and it's gonna be mutas from sasa it looks like he's gonna pull that drone out and this was back in the day when sasu used to play really really fast so, and his Zerg was really, really darn good. It still is, but he could compensate for some mistakes sometimes by playing at 400 APM. And Gangnam Life, always a pretty fast player, it seems like. And I know that RJB has said that he has a super high EAPM, so he doesn't spam much, and it's almost at the level of... Uh, brain. So his EAPM is just extremely, extremely high. I do want to check and just see if any games got played for SCW. Doesn't look like it. Looking. Yeah. Doesn't really look like it. And a couple more seconds. We'll see maybe a chamber come down. It's kind of putting these seconds in a, a unique position. Here is your so he's not going to go with the science facility just yet. Going to build three barracks right here. Maybe get an engineering bay. We'll see. We go with a drop ship first. And there's your engineering bay. He's got a tank. He's going to start pushing right here. And 
as soon as you hit that creep colony, you start sending those guys in, or you, you seize that tank up. So I think he should be t uh, shooting at this sunken first, so he can get that splash damage on this sunken, but he's going to be taking this one out first. And let's see what Sasu is up to. I think I'm just going to do the one game, but we'll see if I do. Maybe I'll do a TVP. So here's your Mutas at 5.30. And I never really knew if Sasu's Muta Micro was that good. So we'll kind of see. Nice, nicely done right there by Kingdom Life. And using that hill to his advantage with those Mutas. Trying to take out one of these tanks. I'm going to keep sneaking this out in. Here's your mutas over here. He's going to get one tank. Ooh, not going to get it just yet. Where's that drop ship? It's got to be coming to the... Here it is. So he's got the drop ship. I think he kind of forgot about it. He's trying to micro over here. And he might just pick these guys up with the drop ship. Getting a vessel, no extra command center just yet. Not spending as money as good. Here's your turret. <coughs> so doing a pretty good job. Let's see if he's getting an upgrade. No upgrade. Queen's Nest on the way. Just point off the one macro hatchery. Well, technically two. Here's another hatchery on the way, though. So doing a pretty solid job. Sasu is. 400 APM. Here's your command center vessel. And armory is on the way. Gonna get another command center. We got 10 mutas right here. We could pick this guy off. He needs to have about 10 mutas. Gonna have to split these guys up. Looks like there's maybe five left, six mutas left. And getting the hive. He's got a couple scourges here for dropships. This dropship never got used. He finally is going to click it. <coughs> I have a cough. Just spot out that vessel right there. Here's your scourges. Another hatchery on the way. And a couple fire bats. Looks like he's. Not completely sure why he's building a bunch of fire bats. He's got a... What is burled up right here? A drone burled up for some reason. Not completely sure. What was the reason? Maybe it was just accidental? Here comes your... Gonna take out both of those vessels nicely done. It looks like he canceled one of his hatcheries. And he's making a defiler mount over here, getting lurker upgrade. Greater spire on the way. And here's your upgrade for Gangnam Live. 10 minutes, 9 minutes. We're gonna start busting through the front. Gonna run these guys on through the back. They're getting kind of stuck on this sunken right here. And we'll see if he just wants to snipe out some of these overlords. There goes one. These guys have range. Three overlords. Four overlords, maybe. Probably take out this Hydro Stun and going to get the Defiler Mount first. Consume's not going to finish. But I don't think he'll get this Hydro Stun. And Lurker Upgrade is going to finish first, so. He is already making those Lurkers. Let's take out this Sucking right here. Here's your Defilers. And gonna lose his pool as well. Here comes your vessel. And Gangnam Life gonna start talking smack. I don't know what that building was. Here's your lurkers though. Guardian on the way. And wow, those guys got smoked. 
A couple takes up here. And he's gonna try to start sniping out some of these drones if he can. Two, three. Just another hatchery. There's your defiler mount again. Get to rebuild his pool. And using these tanks, gonna start moving forward. 107 supply to 52. Here is your Irradiate coming down. Here's your Lurkers though, and Swarm. So this is gonna buy a decent amount of time for Hamburger Sausage. Because an SCB, you might still start building some turrets in here. Doesn't have a huge base though. He's got four. I'm gonna lift these guys up. He's got four barracks. And he's probably just gonna start pumping out the factories if he can. And yeah, nicely done right there. Here's another hatchery. This is a pool. There's your pool. More lurkers on the way. We'll see if maybe a drop comes. Here's your scourges. They're looking for that vessel. Lifting all these up. I'm going to go for a full on all factories right here. I think you accidentally clicked these guys here. Maybe not. Here's a vessel coming in after the minerals. We'll see if this gets spotted out by Sasu. I don't think that Gangnam Life is playing that great. To be honest, not spending his money as good as he should, and he should have a lot more factories here. So, <coughs> scans are coming down. Bringing these on all over. Yeah, I do think he should have a lot more factories here. I think he's going to make four more right here. Lowering his APM a little bit. Going to go with starports right now. And another starport going to come down right there. Here's your overlord. Going to irradiate. Scorgy's coming out. Going to spin. Nicely done. And some hatcheries are coming down for Sasu, getting carapace upgrade. Getting Goliath range for Gangnam Life. So, to be honest, I'm not super impressed right now with Gangnam Life's TVZ. Gain coming down. Gonna irradiate some of these guys. <coughs> Sorry. I am somewhat sick. Yeah, the tanks over here. I mean, it almost looks like it's somewhat corrupt, but it's not. I'm pretty sure. Building his base up nicely. And a couple more starports are coming down. Getting some Goliaths. Looks like he's gonna try to take out a couple vessels right there. And we'll see what Sasu goes for. So maybe he goes tries to go for a drop. He's got a decent amount of scourges right here. We're gonna kill this Hydro Sten. Because it's in the way. He needs to get more gas. Here is a vessel. Gonna not be able to get, take that out. A couple of turrets gonna get built on the side it looks like. And he's got SCBs over here to start building some turrets as well. Gonna micro these guys back. Here's your speed. Eight thousand and five thousand. I mean, he just has so much gas right now. Unnecessary amount of gas. And here's your attack. Time to take out some of these vessels. Gonna burrow these guys up. The 
Take out the Defiler. <coughs> this guy survived. Let's see what the upgrades are. He's got level 2 upgrades. Here's your turrets that are going to start getting used on the side. Turrets over here are going to start getting used on the side. Hopefully that doesn't corrupt this game. But given a decent amount of time for Henry Sasu to kind of build up his base here. Get a couple more gas over here. Red stuff coming down. Apparently Nick Young got he did some boxing and he got whooped, I guess. For the I think mean, that's what player. Did a boxing event. And Adrian Peterson got knocked out, I think, against Lady on Bell. Pretty tough. Pretty crazy. Gonna get some more gas right here, he needs two. And this is why Swarm is so strong with lurkers. That's what makes Zerg so much better. Gonna build some more spores, it looks like. Creep Colony's up here. Get a couple gas. And here's your vessel's gonna go after the minerals. 14k now, and he's gonna scan. Not seeing it. Oh, he saw it pretty late. And Gangnam Life gonna talk some smack. That's the one thing that makes I like about Gangnam Life is he talks a lot of smack too. Him and Hamburger Saucer are very similar. And yeah, probably gonna get some. Let's see if we get some Valkyries. Decent amount of time bought right here. And I think that gain of life needs to switch up his strategy. Going all the way down to 170 APM. I think he needs to just go with like a tank drop or something like that. Here's some more vessels. Going after the minerals. And yeah, no scourges here. And this is gonna do some damage. Gonna burl these guys up. 67 drones for Sasu. Scan coming down. And he sees that Sasu just doesn't have that big of a base. But I do think there's your three upgrades, so he needs to get his other upgrade. Which it doesn't look like he is. Here's your queen for Sasu. Definitely needs to get rid of some of his SCVs. Another row of vessels here, seven of them. So he must have seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. He's gonna make another row of vessels. He's gonna send these guys on in. Let's see if he green stuff these guys. He's gonna take out that defiler while he can, and he's gonna get the right side. And 66 drones, he's gonna lose only 10. So nicely done, but Gangnam you know, Life is slowly just pushing forward right here. Getting a little bit closer and closer. Here's your vessels right here. <coughs> Using the side really nicely side over here as well. 
seize these guys up, take out this guy, and then seize these guys up. Might scan this. Oh, he's got a vessel right there. Swarm coming down. Another more row of vessels right here. Green stuff coming down. Is he going to get one off? Not going to get one off. And Sasu might be able to start moving on out here. He's got the overlords. There's another seven vessels. Looks like he's going to be scanning this. And I heard Sasu picking up some of his units. Let's see if he green stuff this. Not going to. Irradiate coming down. Going to burrow right away. Here's your lurkers getting made over here. Units are going to spawn. Taking out one, one vessel, two vessels. And these guys are going to slowly take out some of these hatchers right here. So here's some guardians getting made from Sasu, and that's going to be huge, but. Kingdom Life is just slowly, slowly getting closer and closer and closer. Radiant gonna come down on this guy. Got the micro that guy back. Here's your guardians. 30k and 5k. It's a crazy amount. Here's your vessels coming in. Go back to the minerals again. guy's gonna survive by 10. Here's your guardians pushing out. 54 drones for Sasu. We'll see if maybe he tries to go for a drop of some sort. Here's your Goliaths moving on in. Let's see if he's got 1-3 now. Still not getting that vehicle plating upgrade. And another row of vessels. He just gets them. Takes them, brings them on down. Hundred and fifteen supply to one eighty. These guys are just chilling in here. These guys have a couple more irradiates on there. You can Use them. There's one. And down to 36 drones. Another one going to come down. And I think this one's going to be over really, really soon. Unless it somehow. Oh, I just don't see it. <coughs> going to burrow up. Yeah, it's just going to be over. So, 14 drones. Getting them life. Didn't play that good, but he did what he needed to do right there. And uh, so, yeah, just going to do the one game. Good game right there. Hope you guys have a good rest of your Sunday. And I will talk to you guys later. Peace.